Hello everybody, it's Bonnie from Bonnie's Pretty Poppet Reborn and Doll Nursery. How is everyone today? We hope you had a wonderful weekend, that you were able to spend it with those that you love, accomplish a few things you set out to do. We hope you're feeling well and have been able to have a chance to laugh and play and joke. Well, today is Monday and we are wishing you a brand new, perfect week ahead, filled with festivities and joy and fun and health and laughter. And that is our prayer for you today. Well, today is Monday. Happy Monday. So we have a few tags that we'd like to do really quick. And I have with me my darling Burke Casp Caspian. He is the Suzanne Kid by Laura Tuzio Ross. And he is representing Monster Monday by our darling little nephew Gilly over at Gilly the Monster and his mommy Allison and he is wearing a brand new Carter's sleeper I'm going to show you all of it later I just wanted to zoom in a little bit because we have some shenanigans going on here so I wanted you to be able to see that too but anyways um, I wanted to share this beautiful sleeper it is a size 18 months it's a little bit baggy on him but what's better than being in a sleeper flannel in the middle of the winter just enjoying Christmas carols and Christmas trees and just enjoying the day. It is navy blue sleeves and it has feet and it has the non-skids on the bottom. It's like a royal blue all the way around and there is this huge adorable monster right in the chest just a big old face. He has uh, a blue body, yellow horns, a big orange tongue the cutest little eyes and nose you've ever seen and he is representing our monster monday also we're going to do new doll clothes by our dear friend jay over at jay dolls uk this is brand new sleeper to our nursery so we wanted to share that and do jay's tag and for the first time in quite a while we are doing cheeky monkey monday and cheeky monkey monday is sponsored by Kay and Louisa over at uh, our cherished cherubs. Kay and Louisa have a de delightful channel. I love their babies and their tags, and they're just so much fun, beautiful ladies. As you can see, the monkeys are up to mischief. Have you ever felt like you've lost control? I have. <laughs> we have Tad is sitting on poor Burke's head, and right behind him is his sister. Um, tally and then if you look down on his lap is tag and right behind tag in the tree is his sister <laughs> tess i don't know there are they've all gone bananas they wanted to pop in today for cheeky monkey monday and they wanted to say hello to cousin rudy cousin bella and all of their monkey friends at Aunt Becca's house and everywhere. Um, and they wanted to say hello and happy holidays. And then finally, we're going to do our one of our favorite tags, and that's Whatever I Want Monday. Last Monday, I did some of our um, vintage decorations, and I asked anybody if they'd be interested in seeing more, because I have so many. I even have vintage cutouts and a lot of people said yes please that they wanted to see more so I'm going to show you a few more of our favorite vintage things well they're all our favorites we love them all while wow, these monkeys and Burke just sit there and enjoy the day we have another before the elf on the shelf he is wearing uh red and white stripes with green trim he's got green mittens a green collar and a green band there's a bell on him. He sits on the tree. I'm going to put him back here as soon as we're done. He sits on our tree. And again, this was way before. I believe these were from the 60s. And this did belong to my mom. And then he has a brother. Um, and this one is in red and white with red and white stripes, white boots. He does not have a bell, but he has a red cap on. Look how cute he is. He can also, um, you can also fold his legs up like that as well. He was sitting on the tree and he is going to go back as soon as we're done. Aren't they cute? 
Those are the old Elf on the Shelves. I showed you a bigger one last year. And uh, Anna, Anna Lee Dolls. This is very vintage. It's the little drummer boy. He's on some snow platform. He has a red drum. He's dressed in blue and green. He has some holly on his hat. He's got his little drumsticks. And he is enjoying uh, playing his drum. And there's the tag. It's still on there. This is quite old as well. Um, and then right next to him, I usually put this one. This is also from Annabelle. This is a little Christmas caroler. She's in red and green. She has a green uh, vest, a red hoodie with a, looks like a little red riding hood. And she has on a red and green checkered dress with brown boots. I put these two together on my mantelpiece. So they're going to go back. And then I have just three more things that I want to show you real quick. These are tabletop blow molds. This one is ancient. It's Frosty the Snowman. Isn't he cute? He's got his broom and his happy face and a green vest. And he has on a red bow tie, red um, gloves. His broom is golden. And he has on a black top hat. Kind of looks like our Christmas tree. There's the back of him. He's a tabletop blow mold. And I have him on my kitchen counter. This one's even older. Another snowman. He's even starting to turn that yellowish because he's so old. He too has a broom. He has on red gloves and a yellow scarf with a yellow broom. The handle is red. And then he's got on his hat that has some snow on it. He too is quite old. The back, there's where the light goes. I don't light these up. I just, again, this guy was on my Christmas, on my kitchen counter. And then here is a blow mold tabletop. It is good old Saint Nick, Santa Claus. And he's in his traditional garb and he has his big bag of toys, the black belt. He has on red boots and he is another blow mold. These I'm pretty sure are from the early 60s, maybe even some late uh, 50s. So that is part two of my um, of my showing you some of our vintage decorations. I still have so many, it's not even funny. Um, I'm going to move back in a little bit so that you can see the rest of Burke. But anyways, that is for whatever you want Monday. And of course, that's by our lovely D over at the Baby Patch. All of these tags are magnificent. All of the ladies are lovely. Please pop over and see their channels. See if I can do this. I think the monkeys might disappear. <laughs> but we'll try. We'll try. There we go. <laughs> there is Burke with the four monkeys, Tad, Tess, Tag, and Tally. And they're sending all their love and kisses. Burke, the monkeys, myself, and all the pretty poppets send love. We treasure you. We thank you for joining us today. We pray you'll stick around. We have another box opening. Yes, I've been naughty again. This is not a custom, though. It's one that I found on Reborns.com that I have on Layaway. And we'll probably be, be, be here before Christmas. Oh, my fingers crossed. So, yes, another baby on the way. And I can't wait to share that baby with you. Thank you, everybody, for welcoming little Shiloh Eden to the group. Uh, that we had the box opening for yesterday. I'll be having her on more, but I did want to share Burke's new jammies and these lovely monkeys with you today and these beautiful vintage decorations. If you're at work, please come home safe to those who love you. And if you're at home, I know you're busy, but take some part of your day to put your feet up, to pamper yourself, and don't forget to eat chocolate. Aunties, uncles, cousins, loved ones, and friends, we love you with all our heart. One more announcement I have we're coming on getting close to 900 and 1,000. I'm going to give a, do a giveaway, and I'll talk more about that later because it's coming up. Hopefully, if some of your friends that you know of have not joined us, maybe see if they would like to join the channel. I really want to do this giveaway, and I'm quite excited about it. God bless you all. And we will see you real soon.